Hi friends, welcome you to my YouTube channel Smart Study Point. Friend, in this video, I will tell you about Theorem 10.5 of Class 9 in CET Book of Chapter Circles. So, friends, let's see what is this Theorem 10.5. Theorem 10.5 is that there is one and only one circle passing through three given non-collinear points. So, friends, in this video, I will tell you how to prove this theorem. So as it is given only one circle can pass the three given non collinear points so this proving needs construction so i will take any three given non collinear points friends non collinear points means the three points are not on the same line so you can take any three non collinear points and then you join those non non collinear points now friends as you can see i have joined these two non collinear points so friends now what we have to do we have to take the compass now and we have to bisect these two lines so i will bisect this line i will keep here i will take more than half i have taken here more than half and i will first do two arcs here and keeping in this point as as we do the line by sector in the same process now you mark these two points so that it will be easy for the drawing of line and you again take the point here and do two arcs to construct these lines See friends I have done here and now it's easy you again mark these two points and now and now using the scale join these two lines you can see friends I have joined these two lines and extended these two lines so friends the point of intersection of this I'm marking here a b c point of inter intersection of the bisector of the line segment AB and BC is the center so friends this point we got this point is the center so now you will construct the radius so friends you can keep the point here I am marking it as O keep the point here and you can draw a radius taking these two points these two points or these two points I am making the now friends so OA is the radius of the circle it's very simple now now you can take it keep the point here the center O and you can I have taken this point so I will construct a circle using this point see friends now I will construct a circle here you can see that it is passing through the it is passing through these three points you can see now the circle here is passing through A, B and C so friends I hope that you have understood this theorem I have shown it very easily so friends if you understood this theorem easily then please like share and subscribe my channel so that i can bring more and more videos related to your studies